The following question is about the combustion of ethanol. And the question states, which volume of oxygen at room temperature and pressure is needed for complete combustion of 0.1 moles of ethanol? So the first thing you need to do is you need to balance, uh, have a balanced equation for the combustion of ethanol. Ethanol is C2H5 and OH, you burn it with oxygen, O2, and it produces CO2 and H2O. And you need to balance this equation so there would be there would be two carbons, so that's two CO2s. Uh, hydrogens, there are three hydrogens on that side, so there should be, there's six hydrogens on the left hand side, so there should be three water molecules. If you count the oxygen, there are four oxygens over here, three over here, that's a total of seven oxygens, so there's one oxygen already on the left hand side, then there should be six oxygens over here, so this, this should be three O2. Now, the ratio in which uh, ethanol and oxygen are reacting is one mole reacts with three moles. So that's the ratio in which uh, the stoichiometric ratio, the ratio in which uh, the molecules are reacting. One ethanol reacts with three oxygen molecules. Now in the question, you're given uh, 0.1 moles of ethanol. So if you have 0.1 moles of ethanol, then it's pretty obvious according to the ratio, uh, the amount of oxygen that would be used because it's one ratio three, that would be 0.3 moles of oxygen gas. So 0.3 moles of oxygen gas would be needed for the reaction. And he's asking for the volume of oxygen. So we, we can find the volume of oxygen because one mole gas, one mole of any gas occupies 24 decimeter cube at room temperature. So if you have 0.3 moles of gas, then according to the unitary method that should occupy, and we're going to solve for X. So using Cross multiplying x would come out to be equal to 24, the molar volume multiplied by the moles, which is 0 0.3. So using my calculator, 24 into 0 0.3 would give me 7.2 decimeter cube. So the answer to this question is going to be A.